right, so that's going to be the first thing I'm going to do before I work on the underside, always for safety, just take off the spark plug wire, make sure it's tucked away there. So there's no chance if I rotate this blade that this thing's going to start. I just got my uh, electric impact. It's a 9 16 socket. Oh, this one looks like it's 5 8. Big question is: Is this is this blade adapter gonna come off? Because uh, these things are usually rusted on, and of course this one's rusted on as well. Uh, so uh, I'm gonna try and get a puller on here and then uh, get this uh, blade adapter off. All right, so I got this set up, guys. Just I uh, got the puller on here. I put the bolt back in for the blade, uh, put it in about halfway through the threads, and I got a three quarter inch wrench here now for this particular uh, gear puller. And I'm just going to keep tighten this guy down. Hopefully. This is going to pull that blade adapter off of there. Yeah, it looks like it is coming a little bit at a time. And it might make a really loud bang when it finally pops. It's getting easier, so that's a good sign. And it's actually coming off of there. Alright. Now, anytime you get these things off, good idea, put some anti-seize on the shaft after you clean up all this rust. So I'm going to clean that off with a wire brush and then maybe a little sandpaper on the inside of this guy. And uh, from there, I'm going to go ahead and uh, put a little anti-seize 